Hi everyone, I am Jia and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, then I make educational study related content and a lot of fun vlogs as well. So do like, share, comment, and subscribe if you like my content. Now in today's video, we're going to be understanding the best revision strategy for you guys, how you can revise it. Because I know this is a very common problem among students. Ki, hai, maine chapter padh liya, but when I open the book and I think of something or someone asks me a question, I'm not able to you know answer the question at all. Or I've studied a chapter do many pele, you know, two months back, but I don't remember anything. now so we're going to be overcoming all of those things and i'm going to be giving you a good strategy that will work for you guys and we'll go step by step the first step is whenever you're even reading the chapter for the first time or you're doing it again then mark all the important points underline keywords uske paas you know write questions regarding that particular part so that next time when you open the book and you want to revise like in social you have like 20 chapters it's like crazy right how am i supposed to read every every chapter mujhe bahut time lag jayega it take me like a lot of days to do it in fact okay so you underline important things you mark through it you write questions so that when you open the book you can just read through those important things and you know rush by the portions and you can complete everything together second step after underlining important things questions is opening a random page on your book after you finish studying a chapter open a random page check if you remember it or not now if you don't remember it that means you have not cleared the concept you have not understood it you have not learned it properly at all so read it again whatever you feel like you know you've not learned it properly read it again read it thoroughly this will help it you know keep it in your mind for a longer time after that is you know going to like give like you sample papers if you're able to answer questions then you're set you're done you're, you know you remember whatever you realized and an important part here is there's a big difference between recalling and recognizing okay recall versus recognizing now if i get a question in my question paper i'm like yeah yeah i know this okay but when i actually write it am i able to think ki okay this is this this is that am i able to recall it so recognizing is like ha ah, i know this but recalling is actually able to write it so you need to have that power of recalling your knowledge which means that it has to be inbuilt okay and now there are two types of people who do, do revision first is those who do one day before exam abhi iska problem hai ki main ek din pehle one day before i'm reading my book and i'm like oh my god i don't know anything i'm so stressed you become anxious and you're like next day you want to do properly because you have so much tension and the second kind of people is that you know they'll do revision very very often but again up overwhelmed ho jaoge doing the same thing again and again it gets very very boring so what you guys can do is you guys can make flash cards you can you know keep going through uh, your flash cards and if you don't have time for this and if you want someone to like you know regulate this i found a very good app that i was using myself uh, and now also i'm using it for my 11th standard it's called spaced revision so essentially what it does is you know har ek chapter har ek subject for the matter of fact in standard 10 and there also are many other courses apart from standard 10 but i'll be talking specifically about that because it'll be of use to you so we have standard 10 course all subjects are there all your you know four main subjects science social maths english are there on the website now what happens is every chapter you open it up you read through it you you know there's a there are short forms for everything short paragraphs about each and every topic after which you have flash cards so they'll ask you questions to check your memory and if you don't know there's an option that i don't know so agar aap i don't know press karo then the next day same question comes back to you again agar fir bhi you still don't remember it again you press i don't know next time when it comes by this time it would have been registered in your memory ki answer kya hai so you put the correct answer and you're like yeah at the third day i ace the answer so it's a regulate of check ki okay do i remember do i not remember you know fun manner theek hai because it's all short so it's very quick also and you keep keep it in your mind like it keeps coming into your mind because again and again they're checking if you remember it or not so that's a perfect form of revision i will suggest that keep checking whether you remember what you studied or not so in the process of checking itself it keeps coming back to your memory and this app space revision or the website rather i'll put the link in the description is something that i'm using and it's a very good app as well so you can definitely go ahead with it you can take a 10 day trial after which if you like the course you can you know go forward and pay the amount and you can use the code cbsc15 for 15% off um so yeah i hope you guys like it because i really liked it now okay so the thing is your graph of revision once you you know study your chapter it keeps going down the amount you remember it keeps going down it keeps reducing but once you use apps like this or you revise in a better way the remembrance level remains constant to a level it doesn't you know go down fully so that's a great way of managing your revision by just checking whether you remember the things you study like you know like i said when you check you're like okay i don't know this so i have to read it again and finally when it comes to the last day before your exam is a very high chance that you remember whatever you studied so what i would suggest is you make a schedule now 
cater to you personally when you have your pre boards when you have your exams make a schedule especially for you ki okay this day i will revise these 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 things this day i will revise these 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 things so that you know ki systematically you can do it when just sit spend even 30 minutes but i suggest those 30 minutes because it'll be worth it you can do one thing on a particular day remember it till your board exams come so your board exams are your ultimate uh, you know aim so yes guys you can master the strategy of revision it's just that you need to understand yourself that how long it takes you to you know learn something for how long can you retain it and keep giving yourself questions test yourself on the basis of what you studied so that it you know remains in your mind as one thing so all the best guys uh, you know keep working hard and the result will definitely come thank you for watching and do like share comment and subscribe if you like this video bye